to Eminence 5. Yes, sir. You already know we're here with the young superstar. The, you know the coach right here. You know what I'm saying? Um, salute, Eunice. How you feeling, man? I feel great, man. I feel amazing. I felt like, you know, I got the job done today, you know? And I'm really proud of myself for the performance I just put on, you know? Uh, I feel great, man. I'm not going to lie. Um, One round battle. Y'all open up the night. You know what I'm saying? I know you got to leave right after this and everything like yeah, that. No, it's not me. It's EK. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. okay. So you chilling. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um, What was the mindset coming into this uh, um, This one round battle versus EK? I looked at it like I just got to go in there, forget all the politics for a moment, take in everything with a grain of salt, mm. but still, like, you still got to – I still got to do me at the end of the day, you know? Facts. I'm not – you know, the fans aren't going to be the ones on stage performing and – got to take the criticism for everybody else you know i'm the one who got to deal with all that so i can take everything with a grain of salt and then i got to still do me at the end of the day you know okay so that's yeah that's pretty much it well, when you look at this battle right here you know what was the difference you know between you and ek in, in, in this battle so what i noticed was the differences was really how we both approach for, okay for, uh, Especially with this battle, yeah, he took a more like talking about my father. That was interesting. Yeah, that, that was. was. <laughs> Only thing is, uh huh. <laughs> like, I like I I like the angle, but it's it was kind of like you know, like my dad can't work forever, you know. What I'm okay. So at a certain point, I had to you know get up off my feet and you know still provide. So. Yeah, yeah, I I was. Uh, Thinking about that angle, like, what what did he mean? Like, what, what's up with your dad? Or yeah. Like... So yeah, my dad was recently. I said in the hands of battery. You know, okay. Like the janitor, and then he retired. Yeah. Uh, and he tried to say your pops can't retire. That's what I was, so I was like, <laughs> I guess, but you know, it, it is what it is. You know. Uh, what but, you thought about that angle? I thought it was. Uh, it wasn't true, but you know, uh, like I. It is what it is. Uh, um, for you, um. You had a different uh, dope approach. God, talk about like your mindset going into like how you wanted to approach this to make sure you was able to walk away with the win. Yep. So with this one, I realized like this. Man, I missed it, baby. It's up. I can't. I had to watch the goal, bro. I missed it. I'm gonna catch the free catch. For sure. Uh, with this one. Yeah. Like with your angles and how you came to him and everything. So the way I approached this one, it was really just a matter of like. Dev Dillon, yes sir. It was really just a matter of, all right, he's going, I know for a fact he's going to take some type of approach because the culture really respects him for his angles. You know? mm -hmm. So, okay, let's do a little counter writing real quick, you know what I'm saying? And just talk a little bit more about me because I know he's going to talk all about me. Yeah. So I might as well, you know, defend myself for a little bit. And also I got to still attack him at the end of the day, you know, though. Uh, and then... That's that's really my mindset was going into it. Make sure I attack and I'm on defense. Oh, uh, for one round, do you feel like you caught the dub? Yeah, in my opinion, yeah. I feel like uh, people gonna really two love this on the rewatch. Man. Appreciate two is flat, man. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like people gonna really enjoy watching this on the on the replay. Uh, but I personally feel like I got it. 